Hello, everyone. Yeah, so this is today's question. Uh, the question that is about a Venn diagram, right here, which shows that how many students in the class like chocolate, ice cream, or both? Yeah. Let's have a look at this Venn diagram to see where the details. And um, so this is the detail we have, and then um, we have the class chocolate as well as the ice cream and then it indicate that in the class we divide into two groups one groups like ice cream uh, and another group like chocolate and then so let's have a look at further details about um, the information given by this question the first one that is two children like leader so it means that right here we have two students uh, or two children they don't like ice cream as well as chocolate and then uh, another information that is in the second point that is there are 32 children in the class it means that in total this is the whole class the number of students or the number of children that is 32 which gives us some information later on we are going to use it to find out um, the answer to all these questions at the bottom and another piece of information that is 26 children like chocolate in this Venn diagram we find out that 16 in the middle that is the overlap between um, the orange and the purple oval yeah so it means that to look into the details right here it means that in this oval yeah so that is this one that is the total number of children they like chocolate we know that 16 of them like chocolate as well as ice cream yeah so that means I'm going to denote this number that is a it means that this student the lump a is the value that is the number of students who like only chocolate yeah so according to this information the total number of students like chocolate it means that we have a plus 16 a plus 16 that is equals 26 it means that this is the number of students like chocolate only 16 that is the number of students who like both chocolate and ice cream so a plus 16 that is 26 that is the number of children they like chocolate yeah so a plus 16 according to this information after some algebra we just find out that a that is 26 minus 16 so we have a equals 10 yeah so that is now this value that is 10 so you just find out that 10 plus 16 that is 26 it matches the information given in this condition we are going to do the same for the next one that is we have the information that 20 students like ice cream that is we are talking about the oval given right here that denote the number of students they like ice cream yeah so again this overlap part the pink part 16 it means that the number of students they both like uh, they like chocolate as well as ice cream so we know that 16 of them they like ice cream and then so but according to this information total the total number of students they like ice cream that is 20 so I'm going to look this number right here B B means that this is the number of children they like ice cream only yeah so B plus 16 B plus 16 should equal 20 it is mainly because that is the number of students they like ice cream yeah so I'm going to erase this and uh, write in a better way so we have B plus 16 yeah so B that is given right here 16 is given right there equals 20 so after some algebra we have 20 minus 16 so which give us 4 it means that 
this b that is four. So in total, sixteen plus four that is the total number of students like ice cream. Yeah. So this four means that among this group, only four of them they like ice cream only, but not chocolate. But four plus sixteen that is this student. They all like ice cream, but sixteen of them they like chocolate as well. Yeah. So this is the information we collect from the condition given right here. Yeah. So you can just verify that ten plus sixteen plus four plus two. That is ten plus sixteen plus four. Plus two equals thirty-two. I mean, thirty-two, not thirty-six. Yeah, so thirty-two. That is the number, the total number of students in the class given in the second condition. Okay, and now we are going to answer the first question. That is, how many children in the class do not like chocolate? Yeah, so that means. We are talking about、um, from the Venn diagram. We are going to look for some information. The number of students in the class do not like chocolate, so we can cross out something. So this group of students, this ten students, like chocolate. So we are going to cross that out. Yeah. So we do not count this student, and then so we have this sixteen student. They like both chocolate and ice cream. We are going to cross that out. So now, when we move on to this four, this four it means that this student, this four student, they like only ice cream. Yeah, and also the number, and we have the remaining two student here. Yeah, the remaining two student, they don't like both. Yeah, so to answer this question, we have this four student given right here. They like only ice cream as well as these two student. They don't like both. Yeah, so four plus two equal four plus two that equals six. That is the total number of student. They do not like chocolate in the class. Yeah, so this is the answer. And then the next question that is, how many children in the class only like ice cream? Yeah, so according to the logic,、uh, according to the information given in this diagram, and、uh, we can find out the answer. That is four, because this is the fourth. Student, they like ice cream only, yeah. Because we are not going to count this sixteen, because this sixteen student they like both chocolate and ice cream, and we do not count this ten, because this ten student they like chocolate only. So, for this question, the answer that is four. And for the last question, how many children only like one flavor? Yeah. So one flavor it means that. They either like chocolate or ice cream. Yeah. So, to answer this question, we are going to look for the information from the Venn diagram, and、um, so we are going to look at this ten. The meaning is that this ten student they like chocolate only. So it means that it likes only they like only one flavor, and then so this four it means that. This group of student or these four student, they like ice cream only one flavor as well. Yeah, so we do not count this sixteen. We do not count this sixteen. It is because that this sixteen student they like both chocolate and ice cream. Yeah, so it is more than one flavor. And for these two student, we are going to exclude them. It is mainly because they do not like both. Yeah, so the this question, the number of student, they like only one flavor. That is ten plus four. The answer that is fourteen. Thank you for watching.